Hi, Charger Engineer. As you begin the process of course planning for your first semester at UAH, your math placement determines a pretty big chunk of your fall schedule. In this video, you will learn more about the math courses that engineering students will take and the order in which you will take them, and how UAH determines your math placement and the math course you will register for your first semester. You should have already watched the Basecamp review video at the start of this module. Most students take at least one math class each semester of year one. Your math placement is important, and it affects many of the other courses you will take your first semester. So you might be wondering, what math classes do engineering students need to complete? All engineering students are required to take the Calculus series, which consists of MA-171, Calculus A, MA-172, Calculus B, and MA-201, Calculus C. These courses are four credit hours each. Your placement determines whether you will start in MA-171 or higher, or start in a pre-calculus class. Pre-calculus classes do not satisfy degree requirements. After completing the Calculus series, most engineering majors will take the Advanced Math series of MA-238, Differential Equations, and MA-244, Linear Algebra, with some exceptions. Cybersecurity Engineering only requires Linear Algebra, while Chemical Engineering only requires Differential Equations. Most engineering students will finish all required math courses by the end of their sophomore year. So, let's talk about how your math placement is determined. The three factors that affect your placement are your ACT or SAT math subscores, your AP, Advanced Placement, or IB, International Baccalaureate scores, and credit from a dual enrollment program. This table shows all the possible math placement levels determined by ACT and SAT math subscores from a level zero, pre-calculus algebra S, to a level 3000, math 171, calculus A. If we consider the level 3000 placement, a student needs a minimum ACT math subscore of 27 or a minimum SAT math subscore of 600. Note that you cannot be placed higher than MA171 using these test scores. To place into a math course above Cal-A, you need AP, IB, or dual enrollment credit. If you are taking or have taken AP Calculus, you will need the following scores to earn credit and place into higher math courses. For the Calculus AB exam, you need to earn a minimum score of 3 and you will receive credit for Calculus A and be placed into Calculus B for your first semester. If you take the Calculus BC exam and earn a score of 3, you will receive credit for Calculus A and be placed into Calculus B your first semester. If, however, you earn a 4 or a 5 on the BC exam, you will receive credit for Calculus A and B and be placed into Calculus C for your first semester. Please note, UAH does not accept advanced placement subscores. You can also earn credit for Calculus A and Calculus B through the IB program. If you score a 5 or a 6, you will receive credit for Calculus A and will be placed into Calculus B for your first semester. If you earn a 7, you will receive credit for Calculus A and B and will be placed in Calculus C for your first semester. If you are or were enrolled in college courses through a dual enrollment program, you may earn credit for pre-calculus and calculus classes and be placed into higher level math courses for your first semester. Students must earn a C- or better in those courses in order to receive credit. For example, if a student takes pre-calculus with trigonometry, MA113 at UAH, via dual enrollment, then that student will be placed into Calculus A. If you don't have ACT or SAT math subscores or any other credit, don't worry, we have another option for you. You can take the UAH math placement test to determine your placement. Full instructions and the registration link for the test may be found on a page in this module. The test is done online, it's free, and you have two attempts. The math placement test can only place you as high as MA171 or Calculus A. 
In fact, if you are placed below MA-171, you can take the UAH Math Placement Test. We actually encourage you to do this. Please note, you can't be penalized for taking the UAH Math Placement Test. So for example, if you are placed in MA-113 by the ACT Math Subscore and you score lower on the Math Placement Test, you can't be moved down. These are the scores needed for the four levels of math placement. Level 3000 is the highest math placement. Even if you have or will receive credit for Calculus A or higher, you will still be listed as Level 3000 for placement purposes. This is really important. Also note that everyone's a little different. So go to the Frequently Asked Questions about Math and English Placement page in this module to find answers to questions you might have about your placement, especially if you're planning to receive credit for Calculus A or higher through AP, IB, or Dual Enrollment credit for this year. Please note your math placement now. It will be very important for the upcoming modules. Thanks for watching.